What's going on? Rob Fish here for BikeBandit.com, and I want to welcome you to the latest speedy video that we're doing. Again, we're doing gloves. If you haven't checked out the Gauntlet series of glove video, check that one out because there's a lot of impressive features on those gloves that are going to transition into these. But more importantly than, I don't want to say welcome, welcoming you, I want to welcome Alessandro from Hi. Speedy Italy. Welcome. Hi, thank you. Great to have you here. Oh, my pleasure. The race glove, the gauntlet glove mentality, obviously is for a certain kind of rider, but there's another kind of rider that may not want the, the, the full glove, the yeah. full armor complement that is offered from Speedy. The short gloves are, uh, are obviously impressive, a whole nother market. Um, we do that uh, you know, very well here in the States. There's not a lot of people that actually hit the racetrack that yeah. ride sport bikes. You've got a whole genre of people that would love this glove because that's going to be kind of a sport adventure touring glove. I'm going to just hand the whole game over to you and please bring us up to speed uh, on, on, the, uh, on the short glove series from Speedy, please. Okay, so thank you. So talking about the short gloves, uh, you know, where Speedy started his history in 1977 as a motorcycle racing glove manufacturer and we won the first title with riders such as Kenny Roberts Seniors. So at that, since that time to modern uh, sports glove, the technologies and, uh, you know, the research went far pretty further. So sure. we have new materials, new design and new solution for it. The gloves I'm uh, showing right now is named STR3 Vent Coupe. So it's a very, very interesting short gloves. It features a 0 0.6 millimeter thick Japanese tanned cowhide. So the glove is extra smooth. We have a carbon fiber knuckle protectors. And you see the shape? So this uh, sort of a fin is not just for aerodynamic or uh, uh, design. The purpose of it is to keep the glove and your hand as high as possible to the asphalt. Because, you know, when you're sliding, you're generating a lot of temperature. And you don't want this sliding to, you know, affect the uh, safety and the protective of the glove and sure. the, all the other stitches. Then the glove has this uh, EVA damper on the fingers. And uh, it's fully uh, perforated and vented all over the fingers. I have a huge air intake on the back of the hand. So I have a lot of ventilation coming through, as well as the wrist area. It's uh, fully covered in uh, perforation. I have uh, extra padding on the side, and uh, I have a microfiber palm, so it's very good handling and very smooth and soft on the handlebar, and a soft piece of warrior technologies. This material here is the very same used on uh, our chest protector, back protector, and other different range of protectors that Speedy can develop. We have an in-house laboratory, which is named the Safety Lab, and our technicians are always trying to, you know, figure out and develop new kind of solution for protect and extend the comfort and the safety of our product. Sure. Gloves and suits and whatever. That thing is slick. I mean, it's, there's a lot of features in a shorty glove. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's very, very comfortable. Of course, it's coming in a whole range of colors. So we have this black and uh, lime green version. We have the whole black and the black and red, which is extra, very super cool. Awesome. Yeah. Um, I know that some people prefer, you know, a three-quarter glove because they don't want such a short wrist or maybe because they are wearing different kind of bikes. For this reason, uh, we have one glove like the TX1. TX1 is a glove that I personally love and it's a perfect combination of uh, sheep leather. So it's very, very, very smooth and, uh, and soft. And then we have this highly breathable 3D mesh. So you have uh, extreme ventilation on this glove. All the fingers is in a breathable materials. You have silicone details on, uh, on the fingers. This is for having very good grips on the levers. Uh, microfiber palm and your double layer on the impact areas. Also in this case, you have the soft water technologies on the palm, EVA damper on the side and extra reinforcement on all the area, like till the fingertips. Nice. You have uh, leather details on the fingers, which is this for both for safety, but it's also very good for comfort because usually like I'm thinking about an adventure touring bike, you have hand guards, but you have a lot of hair coming from the lower part of the levers. So you don't want your fingers to, you know, get frost. On yeah, that sure. Day. <laughs> then you have a polyurethane knuckle shield. Even in this case, we have the very same uh, uh, aerodynamic and safety things we can, feed, we can sure. find in other products like the, the STR3 Vent Cube or our top of the range Carbo Truck Racing Glove. As I mentioned before, this is a three-quarter cuff, so I can uh, choose to wear it below or over the sleeve of my jacket. Right. And it's also uh, pretty long to offer a very good um, 
weather protection, but it's not affecting the ride when you're standing on the pegs, like on an adventure touring or do a sports bike. Very, very slick. That's gonna uh, that's gonna cater to uh, to a lot of you riders out there. That yeah, hey, you've got a street bike, you've got a 990 KTM as well, dual sport. That's that's awesome. You know, to to be able to get that much versatility out of out of one garment is is awesome. That's uh, it's like a lot of the uh, the jackets offered oh, yeah. from Speedy. You know, that's that's very very slick. That is a that's a. You catching this? You should ask for this for your birthday, just as a gift from a friend. That. That's going to wind up in my gear closet. What's next? That's, oh, that's so cool. Next, we have an extremely interesting glove for people riding sports bike or naked bikes on the road. So, you know, like canyon ridings, and his name is Jeb RR, and this is a perfect combination of cowhide, leather, and 3D mesh. The glove is extra smooth. We have a microfiber um, palm with flatter reinforcement. You have a huge reinforcement on the side of the hands, 3D mesh on the palm, and it's fully perforated, so I have a lot of ventilation. Sure. In this case, I have also a polyurethane knuckle sheet split in two parts, so it's very comfortable and following the movement of my hands. And also, the polyurethane shield is fully vented, so I have a lot of air coming through the palm, from the back of my hand. I have a protection on the ulna bone. Right. And other EVA soft, soft damper on the back of the hand. These gloves, yeah, can be worn from uh, sports bike, uh, naked bikes, cafe racer, but in other colors, like the black version, can be worn also for cruiser bikes. You know, sure. we have some uh, some friend of mine wearing this glove on a Harley Davidson because you know it's kind of tactical look, and some people like this, you know, this look also on that thing's, cruiser bike. Yeah, that thing's slick. I mean, you know, you got. I just want to make sure that the camera gets in on those knuckle protectors that you can actually see the venting cavities. That, I mean, this is just awesome. A, a hybrid construction with part leather, you know, like you're saying, part that flex textile in there. It's going to give you a nice, nice solid feel on that. This is, this is awesome. And everything is double stitched. Oh, yeah, you have extra reinforcement everywhere. So you didn't. That's awesome. To avoid, you know, I need the mage to the stitching if you're sliding and sliding, stretching your hand on the asphalt. That's awesome. And that's a, that's a great point where you have something that's a little bit more sporty with the black, white, red color scheme. Or you just can be a little bit more subdued, a little bit more subtle with just an all black while still having a soft city glove, if you will. But just, you know, safety but subtle. I like that. I like oh, yeah. that a lot. Some other riders prefer an even lighter glove than the, G, uh, than the Jab RR. Okay. So I'm showing you the G Flash glove. This is an extremely soft glove. Uh, it's a fully vented and um, elastic fabric. So it's actually, you don't even feel having this glove, but still you have an almost invisible EVA damper on the knuckles. So still the protection is very high. I have reinforcement on the side of my hands, Kevlar stitchings and microfiber palm. And you see all the elastic, how it's following the movement of my hands. And this, uh, this gloves come under colors. So we have the whole black version, the black and white, and this white, red, and black version of it. And we have another glove which is coming in the future, and I can talk about you right now. It's uh, like a cross between the Jab RR and the G Flash, will be named Flash R glove. So it's basically this very same glove featuring the di double part polyurethane knuckle shield. So nice. you can actually have a yeah, full range from the very soft glove to the textile and leather glove, which is the Jab RR. Sure. So you can, you can essentially choose your level of protection exactly yeah that that's this is pretty slick and i don't know if anybody even kind of grasped that 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 is not even available yet but who's bringing it to you bikebandit.com with alessandro from speedy italy giving us the lowdown bringing you the lowdown and the latest info on their short series of gloves from speedy again if you've got questions please click the support tab that goes straight to the sales guys via live chat Pick up the phone, call us, send us an email. We love you, so you should like us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and YouTube. Rob Fish for Bike Bandit saying thanks, and we'll see you soon. Thanks again, Alessandra. Thanks to you. Thank you.